Good morning, this is Ian Doyle, board president of the Oregon Board of Pharmacy. I will now call this meeting of the Oregon Board of Pharmacy to order. Today is Thursday, February 8th, 2024. It is 834 AM. Oregon Pharmacy meetings are conducted in accordance with Oregon Public Meetings Law. Under the Public Meetings Law, governing board governing body meetings are open to the public except as otherwise provided by law. The presiding officer has the authority to keep order and impose any reasonable restrictions necessary for the efficient and orderly conduct of the meeting. Governing bodies are authorized by ORS 192.660 to meet in executive session in certain limited situations, including the consideration of information obtained by a health regulatory board as part of an investigation of a licensee or applicant conduct. All official actions by the board must be taken by public vote and the vote of each member must be recorded. The Oregon Board of Pharmacy serves to promote and protect public health, safety and welfare by ensuring high standards in the practice of pharmacy and through effective regulation of the manufacture and distribution of drugs. That is our mission. I will now call roll for board and staff. For the record, when I call your name, please verbally acknowledge here. Board President Ian Doyle here. Board Vice President Kat Chin. Here. Board Member Shannon Beeman. Here. Board Member Rachel DeBarmore. Here. Board Member Jennifer Hall. Here. Board Member Rosemary Evans. Here. Board Member Rich Joyce. Here. Board Member Priyal Patel. Here. Board Member Cindy Vipperman. Here. Chief Compliance. Officer Joe Ball here. Versus Consultant Jennifer Davis here. Vice Director Brianne Epperhoff here. Finance Officer Cheryl Fox here. Executive Director Jamal T. Fox here. Assistant Director Chrissy Hennigan here. Finance Secretary Elizabeth Hughes here. Finance Officer Jane Lee here. Operations Manager Rachel Melvin here. Compliance Officer Brian Merch. Here. Compliance Coordinator Kim Oster. Here. Compliance Officer Aaron Richmond. Here. Compliance Officer Gary Runyon. Here. For Council Angela Hunt. Here. Will be an opportunity for public comment on Friday afternoon. The board will not deliberate any issues or requests during public comment, such as formal requests. Issues currently under investigation. Request pending before the board or currently proposed rules. To sign up to provide public comment, email your request to pharmacy.board at bop.oregon.gov by noon on February 9, 2024. Board and staff, please identify yourself uh, as board or staff member with your last name each time you speak. Please silence all devices. It is important, it's extremely important that board members speak one at a time and directly into the microphone. Please limit side conversations as they interfere with the recording. Raise your hand when you have questions or comments. Please note uh, that this meeting is being recorded and retained for public record keeping purposes. The board will meet in executive session for most of the day and, and anticipates resuming open session between 30 and 5 p.m. today. Right now is 8.38 a.m. The executive session is held pursuant uh, to ORS 192.660.12 FL, ORS 192.6901, ORS 676.165, and ORS 676.175, which allows the board to meet in executive session to consider 
information or records that are exempt from law from public inspection. Representatives of the media and designated staff shall be allowed to attend the executive session. Representatives of the media are specifically directed not to report on any of the deliberations during the executive session, except to state that the general, except to state the general subject of the session as previously announced. No decisions may be made in executive session. At the end of the executive session, we will return to open session and welcome the public back into the meeting. Is there a motion to move to enter executive session for the purpose of review and discussion of investigations and disciplinary cases at 8.39 a.m.? Member Chin, so moved. Member Beeman seconds. Having been moved and seconded, uh, we'll call roll for the vote. Board President Doyle, yes. President um, <laughs> Member Chin, yes. Member Beeman, yes. Member DeBarmer, yes. Member Hall, yes. Member Hemmings, yes. Member Joyce, yes. Member Patel, yes. Member Vipperman, yes. Motion passes. Uh, we will pause for a moment to transition to executive sessions. 